Hey everybody, it's Dustin again with the WebEx Devices team. And today I'm excited to show you um, actually a second video in regards to hot desking. And if you may have seen the previous video I have uh, using the Desk Hub, showing you how you can use NFC uh, pairing with your phone and the WebEx app to be able to pair and then hot desk to a device and make it personalized. Um, well, we're gonna kind of show that same feature, but we're gonna show it a different way. We're actually gonna show you plugging in a USB-C cable to allow for USB-C pairing, which is a very, uh, it's a very, it's a great way, it's a very um, convenient way and also very stable way to be able to pair to your device, especially if you have issues with uh, ultrasound or, or audio issues, etc. But we're gonna show you how to do those pairings and we're also gonna show you how to hot desk um, using the USB-C method as well. Now, the thing that's interesting here is, is that most people don't realize is that the entire desk portfolio supports hot desking. So today, one of the things we're going to do is show you on two different desk devices exactly how this works. Let's go ahead and get to the demo. Okay, now, I have a very busy screen here, but we're gonna kind of go through what everything is. Um, so down here in the bottom left-hand corner, uh, to begin with, we have got the uh, just a, an image of both a WebEx desk on the right-hand side and a desk mini on the left-hand side. There's also a navigator in there, just uh, ignore that one for now. So these are two desk series devices that are both actually available to be hot desked. And I wanted to show you, you know, two different devices, um, exact same process, same workflow, but I wanted to be able to show you that, you know, there's all the desk series can, can support this, this feature essentially. On the right-hand side, you're gonna see, and I've even got these color coded to match, but you've got the, uh, the desk up top, which I'm sharing the screen. Um, this is actually it inside of what we call awake mode, but it's basically showing that the desk is available and it tells you how to connect uh, your laptop with the WebEx app to open or to book this desk. And then down below, I've got in the, um, the, the, the auto theme or the light theme, uh, which will be white, um, the desk mini and um, it's showing its screen. Now the mini is actually in half wake mode and I did this on purpose because I wanted you to see, you know, kind of the difference between what you would expect if you walked up to a device. The reason I wanted to show you this was because you see that the, it says here plainly that the desk is available and there's a big green bar at the top. This was um, designed intentionally so that way if you're, if you're going into an area and you're kind of looking from afar, maybe you can't read the text to see what's going on, but if you see that green bar, you'll be able to know that that uh, desk is available uh, kind of from a distance without having to walk up to it to see if someone had actually or is actually signed in. So kind of a neat feature to show you what's available and maybe what's not available um, from a distance. Lastly, I have got my PC over here running Windows. Um, I'm just doing this because I've had some people say like, you know, you, you always use a Mac. Uh, I am a primarily a Mac user, but I wanted to be able to show you a Windows laptop to show you that all these things still work both in, in Mac OS as well as Windows. Um, but I have my WebEx app up here. And um, one of the things I want to show you is that you'll notice in the upper right hand corner that I'm actually paired to my Board Pro 55. Um, and this is kind of done intentionally because what I wanted to show you was this is actually proximity paired. So I'm paired using ultrasound and uh, I wanted to show you the behavior, what would happen if you used your USB-C cable and you plugged into your device. Um, USB-C will take uh, priority over any type of ultrasound pairing. So when you plug in your device uh, via USB-C, um, and, and I say USB-C, but it could be a, a USB-A port, um, you know, connected to the back of the, of the, of the device, um, but when you when you plug that in and USB uh, USB pairing uh, takes over, that will take priority over ultrasound, and it won't be trying to pair to any of the other devices around you. So let's go ahead and get through this demo here. Now, what I'm going to do first is I've got my USB C cable here. I'm going to plug it into my uh, Windows laptop, and one of the things you're going to see right off the bat is, and I'm doing the mini first. So you see the mini says that it's signing in on the right hand side. You're probably familiar with this when I did the other uh, demo with the uh, desk hub, but this right here will default to um, five o'clock your local time. Um, I can reserve it for different periods. I can use my little slider here to go back. Uh, let's say maybe I only, only wanna book it until noon, which will be two hours and 25 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and say book desk. So this desk is now getting booked. It shows in the upper left-hand corner here that I'm signed in until noon. And um, that's pretty much it. So now this device is in personal mode. 
And if you remember from the previous video, what that means is if, if someone tries to, to call me or, or, or get a hold of me uh, via WebEx, uh, my device will just automatically ring. Um, any of the meetings I have scheduled for one button to push will automatically show up. I'll be able to join uh, by hitting the, the big green button that says join. Um, and I'll have access to things like uh, my whiteboards or my personal files. Um, great uh, feature set availability that you have here. So you, you've essentially made your desk your own simply by plugging in your cable. If you look up in uh, the, uh, the machine here, the, the Windows machine, you'll see that I'm actually now shared or uh, connected to the shared desk mini, uh, which is you know, now under, under my name. So I'm automatically paired. Um, so what that also means is I can come up here and I can share on the device and I'll just go ahead and share my screen. We'll say save. And then you'll see on the mini, I am actually sharing. Now I actually have it turned off over here. Sorry for that, Let's change that. I don't have my uh, remote sharing showing here, but you see in the uh, bottom left-hand side that the, uh, the screen share is actually going through. And so I'll go ahead and stop that. And then we are gonna go right back to our normal screen. All right, so that was the, um, the desk mini. Now, one thing I'm gonna show you is, is that I now can uh, unplug this device. And let me bring up my uh, WebEx app again, sorry. So I can unplug the device. And um, when I unplug the device, I'm actually not connected anymore. Uh, I am still paired, um, similar to how proximity works. So you'll stay paired for a little while. This will eventually drop or I'd have to do proximity pairing uh, because the refresh token will not continue to go on. But um, even though I'm, I'm, I'm unplugged from the device, um, and I'll go ahead and just even just disconnect here just to kind of speed this up. So even though I'm not actually paired or connected to the device, the device is still in personal mode under my name. So I could take my uh, laptop away if I had to go to lunch or something, come back, and it's still going to be booked uh, under my name, still going to be my personal device. Um, the other thing I want to show you is I'm going to go ahead and plug in the other one, the desk. So same thing here. I'm going to plug it in. You'll see that I'm actually paired to the shared desk. You'll see that my desk is now populating with the uh, hi Dustin Baker, book this desk until. I'm gonna go ahead and book this one until five o'clock. So book the desk. Same thing, this desk is now mine. I'm now signed in. I have the same features and capabilities um, as I would if it, if it was a personal mode device. Um, same thing here. Uh, you'll notice that on the uh, WebEx app, I am now paired via USB uh, to the device. So I have the same capabilities of sharing using the uh, USB pass-through feature. Um, so if I am joining another different or a different meeting platform, Microsoft Teams, Google, Zoom, whatever, um, that app can utilize the, the camera, the speakers, the um, uh, everything that we would have, um, you know, uh, available through USB pass-through uh, in the device on the app, uh, just like you would uh, uh, with uh, any other type of USB pairing. Um, so good. So one of the things I have here I also wanted to show you was, remember when we first started, we had that desk that was available. Uh, and now you see that the mini shows that uh, it's in half wake for a desk that is booked. So you'll see that the desk is booked. I'm signed in until noon, and now I have a big red bar at the top. So showing that this was actually booked and not available uh, from, a, from a distance. Last thing I wanna show you here is um, a neat feature where let's say that you are, um, you know, you booked in and you decide you're gonna go away for a little while, uh, maybe for lunch or stepping away, and then maybe you, you get pulled away or you decide you have to go to a meeting or you're, you're leaving the office and you're not going back and you're like, you know what, I've got this thing booked until five o'clock today, but I don't actually need it. One of the cool things about this and the WebEx app is um, I'll be able to come in here uh, and you see here that I'm uh, paired to the shared desk it shows that I'm booked um, and all I have to do is hit the sign out feature and then I'm gonna say sign out. And if you'll notice on that shared desk, it says you have been signed out. This desk is now available. So I can sign out of any of my devices from my mobile app or from my WebEx app quite simply by um, going up to uh, my, uh, where I'm paired to my devices and I'm gonna disconnect here so I can also show you on the, uh, the shared mini. 
you'll see here it shows that I am um, booked into the shared desk mini as well. I can just say sign out. And just like that, the mini is now uh, been booked out. It's available and ready for the next person to come in and do a USB-C pair. So that's pretty much the video here and the demo I wanted to show you. I hope that uh, this made sense. I hope that you uh, use this feature. Please give us some feedback. Comment down below. Subscribe. I've got, a, I've got a couple other really cool videos that we're going to be working on to show you some things that we're very excited about uh, coming up, uh, especially with the new Room OS 11, uh, which I've been showing off here. Side note to add, um, this does require Room OS 11. So this is only going to be available on the, the modern devices um, and will be a part of Room OS 11. So, uh, you know, if you're using your, your desk or your desk uh, pro today, um, you'll need to opt into the Room OS 11 UI in order to use this feature. Uh, of course, the Desk Mini um, and the Desk Hub, are, are, are that's all that they do. So you'll be able to just use those right off the bat. But again, have any questions, comments, please add those below. And uh, as always, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.